How cool would it be if we lived in a universe where superpowers were a real thing? What would my superpower be? Y'all better not say headbutt. You know, it's been some... Is that a worm on my roof? Bro, we've been dealing with millipedes for like a week now. Little ass millipedes that just show up in the house. We don't know why, but then we, we, should we go back to the spot. We found them like maybe like three hours later and they're all gone. It doesn't make any sense. <sighs> but you see, I'm standing now. <sighs> Sitting down is bad for your health. I decided, you know what? For these next couple of new videos, I'm going to be standing up, walking around, doing my thing. Feels good to be on my feet, but my beanie's getting cut off. What? Good Joe, welcome back. Hey, whoa, whoa. To some more Life is Strange too. Now I know. Stop. Don't play me, Beanie. Now I know. This is Once one of. Once upon a time. Damn. In a while. Okay. This is the flashback. Oh, everybody, every living in their home there, their papa wall. Everybody, pay attention. This is how you remember the, remember the story. <laughs> I'm like, over. One day it was, it was all over. All right. This is kind of sad, actually. Damn. That's when the big brother discovered that the little one was not an ordinary wolf. But a super wolf. And then they worked together to learn how to use his power and to follow the rules for them. Do you see a little they discovered oh, a wow. secret hideout where they could train day and night. They were happy. But the little wolf got very sick, so they had to move on. On the way, a deadly predator attacked them. But the little one destroyed it using his power. I'm acting all mad about this like I remember the dog. What was that dog's name, y'all? What was his name? He didn't have to go out like that, but what was his name? The home of their nearby ancestors to seek help. Finally, the tired and hungry brothers made it to the home of their ancestors. Now you know this is a damn lie with that wolf on the right right there. That's supposed to be Grandpa. Grandpa was not licking nobody when I walked through the door. He was sniffing me like I wasn't family. You know my scent, Grandpa. Fake ass Grandpa, get your tongue off me. The old wolves invited them to stay. They even took care of them. That's gotta be Granny, happy actually. to have a safe, warm place to rest. The little wolf even made friends with a raccoon, and together they went on awesome adventures. Okay. Unfortunately, the hunters were hot on their trail and found them. But the old wolves helped the brothers escape. And the raccoon. Good looks, raccoon. The brothers had nowhere to stay again, so they decided to keep going south to the distant homeland. Of their papa uh, Viva la Mexico, you know what I'm saying? We're trying to get there, and we will. We found a train route. Damn, I forgot about all of this. Uh, just a little vertical iguana, that's all it is. Uh, this still looks like Granny's house. I'm not gonna lie, I'm five minutes into this, standing up, I lost way more energy. I need to go running more. Woo-wee! Before we start the, this is the last time I'm gonna pause it like this. You know your boy just got back from DreamCon? Hey, shout out my baby Maya. Uh, Maya! Maya came and she was a great, great friend. Now that I met her in person, you might see her in the chat in the descriptions. Yo, thank you for the shirt. Much appreciated. You know, thank you. So sweet.
Come on in. What did he just steal? Away, you little shit. Daniel, Is get it? your ass over here now. <sighs> okay, Seattle. Okay, I'm so busted. I had a feeling this was a flashback. Three months before the incident. Now, when I'm doing this game on live stream, it's a lot less immersive because I'm sitting there, you know. Ooh, this boy got some bun, yawn. Man, that would fucking kill me if he found this. Man, it, I, so he better not find it. I mean, I, I hate if, you know, somebody like, somebody was just ready to snitch on you while playing their game. Dead! Dead! I can't wait for the show with the whole crew. I would not do him like that. He don't deserve that. The failure plus a guest, the open house in Seattle. All right, whatever. Let me out. What else you got going on in here? Drawings. Man, you beast. I suck at perspective. I should take a class. You should take a class, but just don't say that you suck at it. Just say that you haven't acquired that skill yet. That's all that it is. I scored it at the skate park last week. Now I need to sew it on. That look like... I scored it at the skate park last week. Now I need to sew it on. I don't know. That look like LJ a little bit. I don't know. What's going on here? Okay, LJ, you know I'm just fucking with you, bro. He look, he look clean with a fresh cut. Seattle Starcade. All right, thanks. A nice little, you know, esports arena ticket. That's cool. A little school book. I hope they don't expect me to remember all this when school starts. You know what? I wanted them to have so a little school bullshit. episode because he was getting We're ready to go to that party. party bills now. Lila keeps hooking me up. Who's up for the bigger. reservoir dive tomorrow? Pass homework. Bullshit. He's going in his B-Day suit. How? There's a big fence. Jump it, track star. Wire cutters, just in case. <laughs> I'll take a rain check. No way out, birthday boy. Answer the phone. There's no backing out. Why? He? Why is he so hard on himself? I can't stand a, a fucking complaining. Let me chill. Dear Z Mart sales department manager, my name is Sean Diaz and I'm a 16 year old high school student with a 3.5 GPA. Mrs. Castillo from the Future Youth Project referred me to your store and department to apply for the position of part time assistant. I have worked in customer service at my father's garage since I was 13 and have experience with people in registers. As a track runner, I also know how important it is to be a part of a team and it's not, since I already know your sports department, I think I'd be a great addition to the Z Mart sales team. Thank you. And I hope to hear back from you soon. Sincerely. Sean Diaz. Sean! Let me make sure my... Okay, my mic still works. Cool, 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 cool. I need to put on the patch I bought last week. Oh, okay. I was going to do this last, but whatever. Got to find a job. Would be nice having my own cash. <gasps> This means my dad is still alive. The fact that this is a flashback. I just registered. Maybe I should get a fake ID to buy booze. That'd be more popular for sure. He looks so young here. Home keys, some water, a bike uh, tool, little drawing headphones. What is that? Oh, a lighter. Okay, for his bond. A little book. That's cool. And a little flash drive. I should upload some pictures from my old phone on this before I get rid of it. Objective is to find Daniel. Have we made all our way around the room yet? Let me look at the skateboard. Dad thinks I'll stop skating if I get a car when I turn 16. Wrong. And Dad seems like he, he don't really know you then, right? All right, now that we're outside the room, this icon means an interaction. All right, let's... I kind of want to look around first, you know? It's been a while since we've been in this He's universe, but I'm pretty sure they don't want me to do that. Nothing's high. Oh! Okay, so let's let's just start here then. Or maybe in the bathroom. I'm sorry, y'all. You know, you know I got to search and immerse. They're probably going to bury me in this It's game. musty. Wish I had more time to play. <laughs> That's for summer school. Okay. 
No way. Oh, no time for this. Where are you? I really gotta find, dude? Of course. Like, I wanna play fucking hide and seek. Still gonna play. Children's book. Mm. Isn't Daniel too old for bedtime stories? Um, aren't you too, too old? I don't know, bro. He got me. Playing Minecraft would get him back to his blocks. Got this for a girl in the eighth grade. Pot of chicken. Minecraft must have cut the check to be mentioned in the game like this. Okay, Minecraft. I used to play with these at Ellery's. Oh, man, I feel old. You know how like certain brands become so big that it's just it's just a household name, like gift from my <laughs> Daniel never got so close to proposing. Like if they would have had a bag of Cheetos in here, I wouldn't even thought like Cheetos cut the check. They would have just been like, oh, it's just Cheetos, you know? Because Cheetos, is, everybody knows what a Cheeto is. My niece knows what a Cheeto is. Too bad we didn't have a clue. She hated all of us. She's three. Maybe four, actually. Now, damn. This thing is so cheap and ugly. I love it. And man, this this what uh this what Joe looked like off bomb for sure every time. So lucky Noah lives downtown. Else they drive me crazy twenty four seven. They clean. They live in their best life instead of you talking shit about yourself. Man, <laughs> my brother's a little player. Lila loves it. Your brother finna be in cheeks before you do. Gift from Lila. <laughs> Daniel never got so close to proposing to her. This dude is a hater. Ooh, that confiscated the play box after that. Daniel was a total rage ball. Okay. How the f I mean, I see the attempts right here. I see the attempts. I see the attempts, but he's, he's still, you know. What is he making with all that? Money? Why aren't you a better big brother? Like, if he's bringing home grades like this, take, take him in your room, talk a little bit of shit, then study with him. You fucking dirty. All right. I would have been pissed if I was there. Hey, neighbor. Asshole. Okay, we go. Hey, neighbor. I, I wanted to let you know I didn't appreciate you calling the cops on me and my friends last week. I know it was late, but it was Saturday. And we weren't having a big party, and you could have just asked me to turn the music down. True, true. Plus, we didn't leave those bottles in the gutter on purpose. Instead, you made a big show and got the cops involved. They hassled us for an hour. They even thought I stole one of my own cars. I'm glad my kids weren't home to see this. Try knocking next time. Your neighbor. I respect it. I don't respect them as neighbors, but the letter, you know... What are you calling the cops for, bro? Over a noise complaint. Come knock on the door. Well, actually, you know what? Knowing the neighbors, they probably would have acted some type of crazy had I just pulled up. They was drinking. No telling what they would have did. Dad got in trouble for his last barbecue. Hope he does it again. So I can come this time. Why was he just looking at me? Ugh, don't look at the camera like that. <clears throat> stay in your world. I'll stay in mine. Uh, Pennywise? Oh, here we go. Get on his ass. Get on his ass. Whoa, hold on. <gasps> there you go. go. Stop it. Dude, I told you to stay out of my room. Ow, that hurt. Yeah, I'm not fucking around anymore. Got it? <gasps> Do you hear me, Daniel? You shall not enter your brother's room. Shampoo or hit yourself. Man. What? You started it, dickhead. What is this crap? Are you fighting again? You proud of yourself? Stop it. Enough. Getting tired of this. Sean, what happened? Now. We were just goofing around, Dad. Don't snitch. I swear. He started it. He always gets mad. He's totally lying. You little enough! You both better listen because I'm tired of this crap. Okay? This is my house too, not your playground. You hear me? Jeez. You guys are working my last nerve this week. 
You okay, mijo? I'm going to talk with your brother. You know the drill. Bedroom and no games. I didn't do anything! Uh-huh. Let's talk. Oh, now. This is so stupid! It's bullshit! Okay. You really taught that book a lesson. <laughs> you done? Hmm? Whatever. Like you're gonna believe me. Daniel's always right. Look. Please? Listen, Sean. I can't do this on my own. I... I can't. I need you to help me. I know you don't want to babysit Daniel. You grow up. You need space. More freedom. I get it. But we're a trio now, and you gotta take some responsibility. That little shit is just a kid. Facts. You're almost an adult. I know that. And I do look out for him. I swear. But he's a little brat. So were you. Mm. And you had eight years of being spoiled before you had to share toys with your little brother. I know it might sound cheesy, but we have to be good role models for him. He's a Diaz, right? Okay. You hear him. I hear you. There you go. I'll try to be super bro. Just try to be there for him, like you are now. <laughs> says me, hijo. I'm late for work. Go talk to your brother and work this drama out. We'll go to the movies tonight if you guys don't wreck the house. I know you love to hear this. But I'm proud of you. Both of you. Okay. He's like, get back to work. Get off my nuts, Dad. Fuck. You know why this scene is fire, though? Because I'm sitting here watching this. And, bro, my parents got divorced. I think I was like... My parents got divorced when I was probably 11 or 12, probably like 10 or 11. And, you know, like my dad was, my dad was still in my life and everything, but uh, he, like, I didn't see him for a few years. And then I, after that time, you know, we reconnected and I saw him like on weekends and shit like that. But man, like just having like a dad in your life period. There's so much shit that, like, as a man, I'm 26 now. Like, there's a lot of stuff that I just sit by myself and I, and I just think, like, man, like, I wish somebody taught me how to handle a situation like this. Like, like being a bigger person, um, my, my relationships with women, how, how to view women, you know? Just a little shit like that. Like, I wish that, you know, I had somebody like this nigga dad, he don't even appreciate him. Like, he's sitting over here, well, I'm making him appreciate him, but, like, it's just crazy to think that some people out there have like parents who are dying to impart their wisdom on them and they just reject it because they don't they don't know no better. But man, how to have like a dad who was like I don't want a dad like that. I want to <laughs> I don't want no dad like I don't want no I don't want nobody, male, female, animal, uh spiritual, nobody going like this to me. But had I had somebody had I had a father figure in my life who was like like, you know, doing his, doing his, you know what I'm saying. I really just said I want a dad going like this to me. No, I do not. I do the, that's my job. What the is you talking about? Over. Let's go see what this dude is doing. Yo, bro, can I come in? Can I come in? It's the big, bad, bad. Relax. No, stay out. There you go, bust in. You don't know better. I said no. Get well, out. You was in my room earlier, so. Whatever. I'm not listening. La 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 la. I come don't on, hear anything. Dude. I would have walked up right behind him and hit him with one of these. He would have been like, he would have been like, la 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 la. This is him right here. La 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 la, I would've went, I would've hit him like this. La 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 la, boom in the back of the head. Now he dead and my dad's gonna beat my ass now, Fuck. 
How did that take a turn like that? I don't know. This is what happens when I'm standing what up. What is he making with all that crap? I really just said I would have walked in and front kicked him. Ganondorf forward till for what? Did this for Daniel's birthday. He was so happy with it. That's hard. Okay, let's look around. How do we get Daniel to talk to us? I'm not just gonna walk up. Let's let's go block. Uh, let's go. Um, let's go. Cause you drew that. Let's go, dog. A uh, creepy toy. This is hilarious. Oh, you kept this guy. We got him from that creepy circus. Remember? We wanted him so bad. Got him for you shooting at that freaking target. Yeah, right. Mm. Dad, aim the dawn. So what? You still won. Because of me. <sighs> Leave me alone. Yo, this is one of the worst big brothers. And don't touch my stuff. Well, we gonna talk about it then. I'm not yeah. gonna... T you gonna touch it anyway. I haven't seen you in forever. That made me give this to you. You always wanted my toys. Does this even work anymore? Not after you took care of it. Poor robot. No battery. Duh. Why are you still here? Let's just try talking to him. Hey, Daniel. Leave me okay, alone. Okay. Come on. Okay, okay, okay. Um, maybe the drawing? Sean, I'm gonna tell on you. Whoa. Don't know who drew this, He's but... Totally I knew he was going to do that. Hey, Daniel. Why are you pouting? A young space warrior should this never is cringe. We need to stand strong against the enemy. Come on, man. I'm running out of punchlines here. I can't hear you. Okay, try his try his toy down here, the plush. Oh, I forgot about Bobby the Yeti. <laughs> I brought it back from that field trip to Vancouver. I mean, who does that? Other than a super cool big brother. Ah, he's right, Daniel. You should totally forgive him. See? I'm not saying it. Bobby does. <laughs> Come on, go away. Oh, now you can hear me? This is the worst <laughs> drama ending conversation I've ever Hey. Ever seen. That's cool. Did you make it? Be careful. Whoa. It's fragile. No problem. Suddenly you're Mr. Careful. Why are you still roasting him? Okay, if I sit down. So, when did you get this? Last month. Dad said I should learn to do stuff by myself since you're not around as much hey come on it's not like i'm leaving home you might as well i never see you we don't even play games anymore we don't do anything daniel i just <laughs> daniel you're not i want to hang out with my friends right sometimes. right you are not of age you're gonna be doing the same thing in a couple of years hi I don't want to grow up. It's boring. Facts. That's why I do what I do now. I'm trying to stay a kid forever. Here. Sorry I took it. That's what you wanted? That stupid watch? You said you'd get me one. At the thrift store last week. But you forgot. Like before. Well. You better keep this watch then. Wow! Thanks, Sean! This is so cool! That gotta be a G-Shock. I'll keep it forever and ever. Oh man, now we're right back to this turmoil. Sean, it took you a while to do the right thing, bro. Like a long time, way too long. I get you 16 and I don't know how old he is. 11, 12, when he was like, you never play games with me anymore. I was about to be like, because you're not good at Smash. You're not tournament, you're not tournament level. You're not ready. I, I need to lab.
playing, he was like playing a level two. So this is the train that we that we got on, or hmm. I'm not gonna lie, standing up in here is kind of cold. Who is that licking my? Thank you. Get the f off my feet. He coming right back for seconds. Mm. That's the dog in him. Mm. That's so crazy that dogs can just do things like that. Like, what nutrients are you getting from that? You'll ever think that animals, like, <laughs> bro, animals know the key to life, bro. They go by their own code. They're they're born and they all know what to do. They all know how to hunt. They all got their own. You know what I'm saying? Another month, and we'll be hooked up for Mexico. Okay, okay. Somebody's gonna try and steal our money. I can tell. Fourteen hundred dollars under a rock. Daniel keeps reading it again and again. Mom, Dad. I told him not to count on. I've me. heard the news about Seattle. He won't. I'm listen. heartbroken. I have no idea what's going on, but I do know Sean and Daniel are innocent. You're the only family they have left, so please help my boys if they come to you. You can reach me at this address. It's a P.O. box I use sometimes. I know you don't owe me anything, but I beg you, please, help my sons if you can. Okay. When did she write that? Oh, okay, so it had to be after the shooting. I'm heartbroken. I have no idea what's going on, but I do know they're innocent. Karen. That's my mom's name, okay? Daniel's watch. Mm. <sighs> Because he doesn't care about it anymore. That was a dream he had. Wow. We used to have big rooms. Now all our stuff fits in a bag. Okay, a little eye mask. Who wrote this? Oh, that's Brody, the homie. Man, Brody would fucking love it here. He probably joined them. The homie Brody. I'm going to reread it just... Oh, no, I'm not. Actually, I remember. A tribe called West. I'm always online when I'm driving. Okay, hold up, hold up, hold up. When you get to Mexico, keep a low profile until you meet people you can truly rely on. In any case, I think you'll be safer there than you are here. Dead cop in the current state of things cannot be a good way to start negotiations. So he's headed to Utah where his mom is battling cancer. We got keys, lighter, night in the forest, some colors. What do you, you got? How the hell did I manage not to lose this yet? Man, give him the Daniel. He probably... <laughs> All right, canteen. A little pipe. You ain't got no bond, though. I know you're trying to put weeds and grass from the fucking... All right. He doesn't talk about it, but... I know Daniel really misses Chris. He was a good He was a good kid. Man. Beaver Creek feels so far away. <sighs> oh, this is Daniel's bag? Oh, brother. A, a camera, a disc, a cassette disc player, hot dog man, canteen. Who is this? Mecha robot, a draw lot, demon blonde. Okay, we can leave that in here. Interstellar traveler and a yo yo. What is all? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay, grandpa. Okay, I took what the hell? The first effing rule. Okay, yep, 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 yep. I'm just trying to get to the boat. Okay, I think it starts. I wish you could stay here with us. I know. I hope you get well. I hope you get well soon, old man. Aw. So we're hopping on a train, a freight train headed south. What the F? But we're closer to Puerto Lobos. Daniel is cold and hungry like me. So glad he loves the train. If we weren't fugitives, this would be a fun adventure. <sighs> if. So it goes. December 12th, 2016, the snow is gone, which means it's go time for us. California, here we come. Ugh. December 12th, same day, homeless again. Not fair to Daniel. Hate this. On the streets, though? There's a high wolf. Okay, befriended some dogs. December 17th. We finally hit Northern California, jumped off the train, and walked forever. But we found a little town. We had to dumpster die for food. What now? Looked for any work. Not a weird. Met a weird guy who said we could get work on a local farm even if we don't have any ID. I know why. 
but no choice. At least we found a shelter. The comeback. What does that mean? I know why. Is that supposed to be like he thinks I'm an illegal immigrant or people on the farm are cool. They don't ask questions. Grunt work won't get us to Puerto Lobos, though. Daniel likes this place. Good thing I can go work on my own. Weird being without him 24-7. Make your choice. A, I miss dad's barbecue ribs. Uh, uh, <laughs> make your choice of, of meat to eat. They're starving. Fuck. All right. Yard work. Okay. He counting up his job duties and his, and his pay. He said, I go stupid. I go crazy. Crazy how many missing person posters there are everywhere. What the F is wrong with this region? Okay, burgers for Christmas Eve. First Christmas without dad. Eats like a piggy. Burger sauce, sesame seeds, meat just stains, meat juice stains, and a Christmas treat. Daniel's masterpiece. What have I become? I don't know what that means. Stocking up one dollar at a time. Putting up fences, nailing shit. Not bad, just boring. Happy New Year 2017. Everyone's out partying, not us. Is that the weird guy? Who f- oh, that's dad. They scribbled out. Oh, wow. That's heartbreaking, bro. Okay, got little cows, little birds, little chickens. Need to practice more. So he goes back to drawing. I miss paint. It was really cool. Citrus vampires only eat the color orange. Okay. Doodle time. Got kicked off the ranch and the motherfucker only paid me half. What the F? He told me to call the police or get lost. Land of the fucking free, bitches. We're so gone. Daniel wanted to see the ocean, so, ocean, so we hitched to Arcata. We got this now. Easy ride. Glad we could do this for free. And the water always makes me feel better. Daniel had fun. Yay, shine. Hippie ground zero. Lots of weed and dancing. I want to kick it there for a minute, player. Would vampires suck bloodshot with such would vampires suck bloodshot eyes as many cocktail sausages? What the f January twenty second. F the what? We bumped into these hipster punks from the Christmas market. They actually work on a weed farm. Off the books, well paid, they invited us. Happy fucking new year. Bro. Cassidy. Okay, hold up. New love inches. She's so cool and different. From planet zero F's given. Sings like a pro. Jokes funny as hell. Daniel's not sure about her. Everyone loves him though. Except Meryl and Big Joe. So his chick's name is Cassidy. Meryl and Big Joe do not fuck with Daniel. Like ain't all smirks. Like ain't all smirks. My arms hurt from weak, but getting strong. Need more sleep. I think she likes me. Shit, that looks lethal. Okay, she got tats. Who she, who she killed? Finn the Green Philosophy's leader of the gangs. Knows everything about... Oh, Finn. Okay. Finn the Green Philosopher, leader of the group. Knows everything about weed. He's also the sweetest guy I've ever met. Taught me everything about trimming and shit. Can't figure him out, but he's smart. Only Hannah can drag his ass. He's a knife master. Like hanging out with them. Oh, I like hanging out with them, though. Amazing sunset. We watched it in silence and smoked the joint. Okay, the homie Finn. It's fun to draw Hannah and Penny. They look like anti-fashion icons from Santa Fe and Detroit. I think Hannah hates my guts. She's older and thinks I'm a fake. Is that what that says? Yeah. Penny has a theory for everything. Paranoid much? But he makes me laugh. We had to clean the greenhouse today. Fun. Feels good to make money every day and save up. Met the new workers from Europe. Anders and Ingrid. Or Ingrid? Cute couple. Makes me want to travel overseas someday. And I had a long talk with Jacob. He likes a little bid. He's lived... He's Oh, he's like a little bird. He lives in some religious commune from Haven Point, Nevada. Looks... Like now, what? 
looks fine here. Free? Oh, he's, he's like a little kid. Got you. Meryl, the owner. Big Joe, the goon. 23rd, February 2017. Had a few beers. Daniel's asleep. Same night every night. He wants to train more, but we don't have time to... We gotta hide. It's not easy. I'm gonna go get a beer myself. I just dropped my... Damn it! Yep. I'm a real man now. Kind of. It's time to get up. I think I've seen everything. Instead of a beer, I'm having a f***ing kombucha. It ain't the same. Put your hey, shirt Batman. back on. Had a good sleep? Oh. Hi, uh. Yeah, I, I did. Thanks. Nice. Okay. I better hit the shower before they use all the water. Right. Up there was a dude. Hold on. Not <laughs> free to nipple, shit. Humboldt County, California, two months after Beaver hey, Creek. Sure. She won. Breakfast time. I better not get demonetized for that. It's 2019. I'll be pissed. She said breakfast time. There's so much to see, so much to <laughs> click. Girl is even more of a sleepy head than I am. Jeez. She's way messier than me. It's hard to believe. I can't believe I just dropped that beer all over the fucking ground. Signs. I do love these trees. Ancient and majestic. I sure do love beer. Fucking delicious and whatever, I'm over it. What's up, what's up, little uh, pumpkin? Yeah. Like you don't get pet enough around here. Just gotta make sure he on your good side when shit pop off. It's never been that kind of game. It's nice to sit here together at night. Like we're a part of something. Sit and draw? I don't feel like... Alright. I've looked enough. Time to draw now. Did you see all that fog earlier? Creeps me out. I don't know what's inside. I like that movie. This so Yep. I'm up for some heavy barrel lifting tonight. Yay. Us. Okay. Coffee time, Sean. Man, Organization is key. Sit your ass down. Oh. Yes, sir. <laughs> you ain't gotta tell what? me twice. You hear that? Um, I heard nothing, Penny. Mm. Why the dog Maybe moving like a slippery, brain. slithering snake? Never mind. You can't hear? Only me. I don't understand. Why? How you miss all those insects? How the fuck? The swarm is coming. Wait. Wait. Do you mean cops? Like coming to bust us? Sean, the motherfuckers is gonna shut down all the farms. Make room for Big Pharma. Mm. You'll see. No way Big Boss can pay them off. It ain't gonna happen. That would be shit for me and Anders to lose the job. The cash is good for us to travel. Same here. Plus, this was a steady gig. Don't want to hit the road yet. Tanya won't either. Don't puss out if the narc show. Meryl takes care of his peeps. Yeah, he's a major dick. But fair. He always puts us to work every season. Some of us need this shit job. Not the tourists here. Cush gig. But not when they legalize that shit. Then you can work legal on the farm, right? Not if the government steps in. Then the pigs, pill pushers, all bad. Mmm. 
It's legal in Washington. Facts. And it's worked out okay. It's gonna be legal everywhere. Soon, anyway. Legal but controlled. Did you just By see who? Sean's eyes? This man lit as a bitch! The bitches who made it against the law. Yay, freedom! I don't know. Things have to change. I got these bug bites on my um, arms. Um, did anybody see Daniel? I haven't seen him this morning. I saw him walking with Finn. They were headed to the lake. Thanks, Ingrid. I better see what he's up to. Tell him no swimming. That lake is toxic, man. Nasty. All right, let's go find Daniel. I keep thinking you're Dutch. Uh, I think you forgot something, Sean. Funny how I like being out in the forest now. I actually feel... Where from again? Free. Sweden, Malva. Oh, uh, you wouldn't hear about it. Sorry. Come on, bro. I'm trying to find my, my little. Bad. Yeah. Not your coffee, boy. We share. Always. Fucking relax, my dude. <laughs> A long fucking way to work. Fake ass. Uh, you look like I don't yeah. know. Been working little for Uzi three years in a coffee shop to pay for the trip. You some little, oh, little Uzi squirt, squirt, bitch. Look at my face, oh, little yeah. Uzi squirt, bitch. Good. What's up, Jake? Hey, Sean. Not much. What do you got going on there? Uh, this is a birthday card for my little sister. <sighs> Don't laugh. Aw, that's cute. Where is she? Oh, uh, she's with my parents, of course. I, where else would a nine-year-old live? Get out the picture chair. Oh, uh, shoot, I mean... I didn't mean Daniel. I'm... Kind of jealous you get to hang out with your brother all the time. But I, I bet it's hard to be his brother and father figure. That's my job now. Full-time Daniel Wrangler. He's really lucky to have you. Hey, since you're such a pro big bro, what's a good way to end this letter? Goodbye sounds a bit lame, right? Well, what is she into? Like anime or video games? Uh, puppies? <laughs> she has a pet chicken named Alexander. <laughs> Sarah loves that thing, but it creeps me out. <laughs> <laughs> Why not draw a creepy portrait of Alexander? Mm -hmm. Good idea. Fire. It'll match my <laughs> chicken scratch perfectly. Anyway, thanks for your help, Sean. I gotta finish this before I get ready for work. Don't want to be late, or Big Joe will eat me for lunch. You and me both. See you later, Jake. Sean, thanks again, man. No, any time, bro. I'm glad I could help you. Can I meet this Big Joe feller, or not You're yet? So lucky. He gets his own, his own, his own moment. All right, a little shower. Okay, you know it stink over there. I'm cool on it. They were headed to the lake. Oh, okay. I'm gonna go to the lake and I find my brother in a minute. Let me just try and make peace with everybody, cause I know Jason is a little moment. On moon. What the fuck, man? You're awesome. Come on, once again. Yes, I'm the man. <laughs> <laughs> Holy shit! That was dope! What's up, guys? Morning target practice? Six bullseyes in a row. Kid is a fucking ninja! Hey, we didn't want to wake your sleepy ass up. Yeah, thank you for that. You okay, Daniel? Hey. Seriously, I've never seen anyone throw like that. He's not too young for Blaze, bro. You fugitives. Wow. Finn trained you well. Six full size dude. Yeah, I got better. Lucky. You can't throw a baseball without hitting me in the nuts. How did you learn to aim so good? Practice. Yeah, right. Hey, wow. What's up with you two? I should have let you know, but, but I'm watching him like a hawk. Seriously, much respect. He's like my own blood. 
And not that I'm as hot or cool as his big bro. At least you know it. Yo, Sean. <laughs> At least you know it. Idea. I want to see if Daniel inherited the family blade skills from you. How about a little demo? It was my turn. Come on, let's give the man a chance. Okay. Yeah. I'll take a shot. All right. Come on, Daniel. Cakewalk. <laughs> oh, he, oh, he, oh, fuck that. Oh. Miss. Oh. oh, wow. I rule. <laughs> Sorry, well played. Sean. Well played. You're not a ninja. Well played. But you're still cool. Well Just played. ask your brother for help next time. Well played. <laughs> yeah. What would I do without him? Hey, don't look at me. It's not my fault if you can't throw. Woo! After that workout, I need some more fucking Java. Wait! Don't go yet. Uh, it's all good, Daniel. We can practice later. Yeah, if it's cool with. <laughs> this guy thinks he's gonna be. <laughs> Love you, man. What now? Daniel. What now? Daniel, I can't believe you cheated. What? What do you mean? Come on. Don't play dumb. You're showing off in front of Finn. You want him to find out? Finn is cool. He wouldn't tell anybody. You don't know that. You're gonna get busted, Inano. You need to listen to me. Stop calling me that. I'm not a kid anymore. Daniel, don't. Why? See? Stop, Daniel. Now! Or what? I said stop, Daniel! Don't run uh, me! Uh. Daniel, okay. Sean, I, I'm sorry! I, I didn't mean to! I'm okay. It's fine. I told you. You're good. But you don't have control over your powers yet. Yeah, but we stopped training since we got here. You'd rather hang out with your new friends. Well, because we need to fit what in. What is that? I want to keep that job. Is that the dog? Okay. But Bro, right. is this the same uh, slippery, slithering serpent do some dog? Later today. What the cool. f is that? Yeah. Let's go by the lake again. Wait, what is that? What is that for real? What is that? But, is Sean, that? how long are we going to stay here? It's been like a month. I know, but we need more money to get to Puerto Lobos. Remember? It's going to take forever. You should try and find Mom. Since we have her letter now. We already had this conversation. Sorry, Daniel, but we can't. We don't even know where Karen really is. And we can't risk getting caught while looking for her. Ew. She's <laughs> one of the reasons we're out here. That's why we're going down to Mexico. How come I never get to choose? I'm the one with the power. This has nothing to do with you and the power, bro. I hear you. It's not fair, but you're my brother, and my responsibility. I have to take care of you. I know, but I'm not gonna be a kid forever. Finn treats me like an adult. He understands. You're not his little brother, dumbass. Uh-oh. Big Joe. Uh-oh. Why does the watch matter? Wait, wait, you got, you got a new watch? Man, ask him about that watch! Hey, you don't wear your watch anymore? Oh, okay, okay, okay. What? Oh, no, nah, I put this on instead. Finn gave it to me. Pretty cool, huh? Yeah, pretty cool. I didn't know you was gonna be salty. Hey, I'm trying to figure out what the, what oh, watch? Remember what I said, low profile. <sighs> yeah. Okay, we're cool. I don't like working on a farm. I know, it could be way worse. We're making cash, you know. Okay, okay. Wish we could send Chris a present. Aww. Or something. Mommy Chris. Or maybe just check on him.
We will, Daniel, when we're safe and far away. I know. I had fun playing hide and seek last night, especially in the dark. You weren't scared at all? <laughs> Come on. Not with Finn. We had the best I'm so sick of hearing about this dude, Finn. Finn was trying to get somewhere he can hide, duck off, get a little quick hit in, and come back to you lit as a bitch. You know, he can't, he can't deal with you sober. But guess who got to? Your big brother, dude. You stressing me out, but Finn get to get, Finn get to hang out with you blown every single day. And you sitting up here thinking he actually like you. No, he's high. He doesn't know any better. But I love you. Okay, Daniel? I need you to get your act together. Aw, oh, shit. Hit them niggas go. Which one do you think is Big Joe? The one with his hands by his waist, standing menacingly, ready to, ready to be hostile? Sit here, my man. I need a bodyguard like you. Cool. Tell Sean to get me a knife. Sean, be cool, bro. Be cool. Let him have a little friend. Y'all are still fugitives. Y'all forget that? Mind if I sit here? Oh, shit. What's up? What's up, Cassidy? Sure. <laughs> Why so serious? Uh, nothing. Just think that watch really bothered cool. him. I'm always worried about my city boy. Everyone okay. here? Oh, shit. This isn't a fucking school bus. We're late. It's crazy how fast your life can change, bro. Like, you really got to be mindful of the decisions you make. <sighs> some shit is unavoidable, but some things, y'all really got to listen to that small little voice in your head that say, hey, you shouldn't do this. this. These kids used to be school students, and now they work on a big-ass weed farm running from the police to escape a murder charge that involves a police officer, a dead police officer. How do we even hey, get there? Because of so bitch ass neighbors. Whatever, dude. Not. Just Bye. give me more booze. <laughs> you know? Really? Yeah. I don't bullshit you. Some gutter punk. Jump. You're not off. listening to anything I say. So I'm cutting that. Are you? Yeah. What? Jeez, yes, I am. Cut me too. The party. Oh shit. Too, too much, much sex, guys. Are you okay? Too much sex. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> I was. Two peas in a pod. These ones. I'll show you the battle oh, scope. was so high last night. Hey, Sean Jellix. Cool. Nah. Sean Jellix. Cool. Nah. I love Just you keeping an eye out. You that, know? Though. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Big brother watching. Hey, who's the next That's master here? That's cute. I'm deaf. Did you lock the tent? You want to see stuff for showing in that email. So. Wrong. How do you feel? You went back for the lighter. Who knew this little tree market snowflake would end up here? <laughs> With us misfits. Well, Man, we I still feel like an outsider, you know? Ah, oh, you're doing great. Trust me. I was way worse than you and I joined the gang. Really? Please, don't hurt me. Looks like you found your oh, no, Hey! I'm gonna shut the fuck up back there. I can't hear my music. Damn, Big Joe. Guess what? He was on his secret sat phone again this morning. Speaking Romanian and shit. Oh no. Here it comes. He's Agent 420. And he has a license to cook. <laughs> um, what's that? Told you a thousand times, Big Joe is a clone. They come from a factory in Silicon Valley. There you go, be the bigger person in front <laughs> Maybe of everybody. He's just the factory reject. You don't have to roast him like that. Hey, just don't be so mean. He's right there. Oh, Sean, are you crushing on Big Joseph? Oh, they finna oh, roast me now. I should have known better. Fuck. So Sean loves Big Joe. Sean loves Big Look Joe. Look at this dude, Daniel, shit, talking you're shit. You're all in love with Big Joe. You can't stop talking about him, I swear. But his ass is too big. <laughs> <laughs> right on. Come on. <sighs> yep. Yep. He's kind of a mystery. Hey, mic down back there. Enjoy the scenery for a change, for fuck's sake. Big Joe, no, you want to be in the back with us so bad. This nigga mad because he can't hear us. That road too loud. 
We having a good ass time and Big Joe mad about it. It's cut it. How long has that taken me? Dear Lord. I'm just seeing title screens. I'm tired. Yeah, me too. Let's try to go to bed early tonight, okay? Yes. Please. And no wheat. I'm so fucking tired. Stop your bitching or get out of here. Hey! Jeez. He gonna be a problem. Not confront him. Confront him, I don't give a f What's that? Hey, come no, on. That's not cool. That's not cool. At all. Uh, are you really shit talking me, Cheech? <laughs> huh? Forget it, Sean. Seriously. We're late. Get your fucking finger out of my face. Hey, um, you're gonna get us kicked out of here. Sons of Anarchy? Well, I just wanted to. What? Be a white knight? I can take care of myself, Sean. Bro, that guy would have beat you down. Uh, nigga, you got powers. Beat him down. Every time I throw a punch, I want you to do some uh, some uh some Avenger shit, whatever power you got. What what is his power? To push? He an airbender? He would have beat you down and you and you would have jumped in. Dirty mop head. Why do both of us have mop heads? That insult don't even work in this game. Oh, thanks for coming. <laughs> I'm not your way, right? Uh, no, no, we're sorry. We, we Who just... is that? You don't get paid to be late. Next time you won't Bro, be. who is that? Desmond? How did he get in the game? Listen up. I need two teams today. Finn, <laughs> Desmond, <Penny. laughs> Anders. Shout out RDC and World what's 1. your name will clean up the mess from the storm. Yeah. The rest of you get to sit and trim. <laughs> like I want to go pick up a bunch of shit all over the camp. Hey, you want to okay, trade so places? Okay, so he's a little light in the Shut loafers, up, okay? You got a deal, kid. Yeah! I get to go outside. Hey! Yes? Be yelling. Hey! Just what are you doing? Don't get it. This is work, not a goddamn summer camp. You're right. You're right, sir. I apologize. You're not special. Fuck. There are dozens of hippies like yourselves begging for work at the next town. Kid, your dad should teach you to shut your mouth. Finn. You better watch your guys. Of course, boss. No problem. Okay, so move it. Yeah, you heard the man. Stop fucking around and get in your teams, all right? How did we get linked up with the Big Joe? Hold oh on. Oh my gosh. Daniel, stay close. Daniel! You and me are gonna talk. <sighs> What's up, sir? Remember. I'm only letting you and your brother work here because Finn put in a good word. I know. We really appreciate it. Thanks. Yeah, yeah. No ass kissing, please. Just watch out. Next time your brother fucks up, you're both gone ASAP. Look, I'm not trying to bust your balls, but this is a pot farm and he's a fucking kid. Fair. You hear me? Got it. I'll keep him out of the way. You better. This business has enough shit already. This is gonna troll him. What kind of shit? Jesus. What is this, an interrogation? I know he's gonna act like this. Oh, uh, no. I'm sorry. Okay, time's up. Get the fuck out of here. You got a lot of work to do today. All right. Uh, thank you. How you gonna tell me get the fuck out of here and this was your meeting spot? We could have went outside. We could have went into your office already. And that dog is still here in the way. Hey. You okay? You know, I'm fine. Now for the fun part. I need this all done by tonight. No excuses. So get on it. We're listening to you talk, sir. 
All right, we good? Yeah, finished playing boss with his crew. I told them they'd all work late if they didn't finish on time. I hope so. Okay, I gotta make some calls. Well, what are you waiting for? You know the drill. Joe, we're working. What? Dude, this sucks. This fucking ass. blows. I feel like I'm in prison. Yeah, you can't get kicked out. Shh. Mira almost kicked us out because you're a big mouth. What part of Lilo don't you get? You shouldn't even be here. Sure. I bet you wish I wasn't here. Oh, stop. I can tell. You know exactly what I meant. Oh, I feel you, Daniel. Sometimes I get stir crazy in here, too. Look, I know you guys are having the time of your life here, but I'm not. So shut your mouth and give me some quiet for fuck's sake, okay? Well, why do you stick around then? None of your damn business. <sighs> but I'd be long gone if I had the chance. Trust me. All right, man. Just pick a bud and get to it. All right, there's nothing else to do. Let's pick a bud and get to it then. To cut, use A and D in perfect. You guys are all the same. Cool, let's be trimigrants. Then you barely work for a month. This is Joe, my life. Come here for a sec. <sighs> Shit. It's always something. Yo, Big Joe needs to need to smoke some of this. Damn. Can you folks put a lid on it? We got shit to do here. Whoa. What's whoa. this? My fault, Damn. my fault. Easy for you to say, cowgirl. Some of us have to work. Please. I bust my ass like everybody else. Uh-huh. Don't even. You're always looking for an excuse. Ooh, it's 420. Hey, Sean, let's talk. Ow, my arm hurts. Wah, wah. Get off my crack, Hannah. <laughs> We've been stuck out here for two months. I didn't come out to California to live on a fucking farm. I want to see some Facts. water. Are we going to squat out here forever? Build a house? What? Stop. You know we voted to stay for a while. Once it's legal, Just we ain't got no more job here. How's it going? Same as always. They want everything by tomorrow. Right. Everything by tomorrow. I'm just over this place. Then go! Ugh. Take the fuck off. If we're a family, we stick together. You're on the bus, or off the bus. Hey, everybody there you chill. Go. I'm waiting on you to say it. Let's not get... Sean, step Whoa. back. This is our business. Just grow up, Cassidy. Stop acting like a princess. Thanks, Mom. Anything else? Yeah. But we don't have the time. Did you fall out of the wrong side of the tent or what? That's not Shit. my problem, Jason. You're clueless. You know the drill. Do your work. Yeah. Sure. Fuck this shit. Hannah, sorry. I know. Hey, I don't want to fight. It's been a long, crappy week. Just keep it fucking down in here, okay? <laughs> I couldn't take too much of that, bro. <laughs> what is this gameplay? Oh my gosh. This shit was going on for way too long. That's the thing about Life is Strange is like, they drag shit. Cheer up, my little Sean. <laughs> Trust me, it's not as bad as you think. Other farms in the area is just straight down exploit your ass. You gotta be careful with those scissors. They're sharp as fuck. Yeah, no shit. Oh, you'll get scars, but you'll get it. <laughs> Part of the fun. Ain't sexier. He cool as hell. Later, Big Joe. Smile, asshole. So, did you have a good day at work, honey? I did. Love the Jerry Springer moment, when Hannah and Cass started picking on each other. <laughs> yeah, they love to start shit with each other. 
then get high. <laughs> Short term memory loss. I really don't care about them. How was How your, was day, your bro? day, Did you have fun outside? <laughs> nope. Picked up branches and shit. Got covered in mud. Would not recommend. Still sounds better than sitting on your ass all day. I feel you, Sean. As always. <laughs> That's why you're such a good fit for the family. You totally hooked us up. A job, cash, friends, safety. Sean, everybody's cool with you two. <laughs> Daniel is your secret weapon. I don't know. He's way too young for this bullshit. You gotta be zen about this. The more you try and control him, the less you have. Mm. It's deep, huh? Swear. He acts just like me. <laughs> That's how I know he's smart. Uh, he's also got a kick-ass hermano. <laughs> My brothers are like that. So, what's your story? Um, I mean, you don't have to tell me, but... Yeah, I was pretty lucky. My parents were... Okay. <laughs> I had three big brothers who spoiled me. Aww. <laughs> you were the baby boy? Like Daniel. <laughs> but my family was kind of... Mm, messed up. My dad was like a... Front for hot cars. Yeah. He'd steal, strip, and sell them. My brothers and I helped him. You know. Typical shit. Till we got busted. <laughs> Fucking feds wanted me and my brothers to testify. <laughs> but my dad narked on us instead. Oh, wow. Damn, Finn. That sucks. That uh, What happened? I went to jail. When I got out, I was like, fuck everybody. <laughs> I, don't, I don't blame you. So I hit the road, Jack, and... Anyways, I found a cooler family out here. You know? I'll get out new well, things. Mexico is the ultimate road trip. Not to Daniel. He doesn't even want to go. At all. Instead, he wants to go to Arizona to see his mom. Fuck that. It can be tough, growing up, not knowing your folks. He needs closure. That's all. Give him time. Mm. He'll follow you anywhere. Okay. Anywhere. Okay. Therapy's over. Oh, yeah. I gotta move those water tanks for the shower and stuff. It's cool you're doing your part, huh? Finally. Glad I can help. All right, what is my job? Move my what to the what? Hey, Daniel. Thanks for saving my back. I owe you. Cool. Hey, you said we could go training today? I did, I did. Ready when you are, young master. Yes. Let's meet at the lake. Sweet. But can you do it without your power? Oh yeah. I can do better with my own skills now. Next level. Onward. Ready to rumble? I am so ready. Uh, Team Howl first? I love it. Let's start with our Team Howl. Woo! T.S. Lobos. Oh, oh, oh. I thought he wasn't gonna do it. I'm like, come on, little bro. Oh. Finn ain't got to you that much. He must be past yeah. you it. We still sound okay. Now, let's do this. Come on. Alright, come on, pimp. Hold up. Too many people over there. Let's hit the other side. Hmm. Now, last time we did this, I had to help him over this. When I didn't, he ate dirt. So let's try it. 
The other side of that log looked secluded enough to be out of sight. Damn, you know what you're doing. Hey! <laughs> Your face! Come on, <laughs> I wasn't gonna drop it. He got me though. Very funny, man. Oh, with the gentle landing. Okay. He What's said, up, don't tell fun? me I can't control my powers. I got control. You can control your your I'm about to I wanna fry you up, dude. Train destruction. Train control. Train precision. Control. Uh, That's fire. Think you can lift all those? I know I can. His destruction is A1. He killed a whole ass panther or cougar, whatever that was. And y'all seen that motel room? His accuracy. He's proven that too. Yeah, go ahead, Harry Potter. How cool would it be if we lived in a universe where superpowers were a real thing? What would my superpower be? Y'all better not say headbutt. Could be cool! Whoa, Daniel! That's a... That's amazing! Is that all you got? Okay, well let's move on to... We'll do destruction last. It's different here in the... Daniel likes pine cones. Let's have a little fun with those. Pick a rock. Any rock. Okay. And... Let's test your aiming system. Target in sight. Locked and loaded. Locked and loaded. Alright, come on. Let's see what you got. Ugh. Awesome. Okay, you're good. I try to fake him out with now, left. Let's spice things up a bit. Bring it on. Holy oh, shit. some swag! That was not a fair fight. That's right. What's next? Aw, that's not hard. Right, uh, Sean. Come on with, come on with these lessons, bro. Ew. These need a little harvest. Hmm. Let's try this. I want you to focus on these ugly mushrooms and blow them apart. Dude, it's toast. I'm waiting. Or maybe you... What the? <laughs> wow. <laughs> he better than you remember, huh, Sean? That was some next level shit, Daniel. Thanks. I've been... training on my own sometimes. I know I haven't been around a lot lately. You didn't tell anyone, did you? No way! Why would I? Not even Finn? No. Jeez. You don't even trust me. I just asked. Whatever. What's wrong with you, man? I don't like this new emo Daniel. You keep throwing your attitude at me for no reason. Right? Sick of it. Am I a bad big brother? Because I hang out with other people? You're always with them! That sucks. Oh, come on, Daniel. Bet you don't even want me around anymore. Don't say that. You know it's always you and me, and I know. I mean, never mind. That's it, enough. You're being a brat. Can't say anything without you having a shit fit. We're family. 
What just happened? We still have a long way to go. And we have to go together. Right? I know it sucks. But you have to grow up now. Mmm. Stop it! Stop it, Daniel! No! They, they don't hear that at the camp? Nobody cares about that loud ass, thunderous roar in the river. He said, he said how's this for growing up? Stop it. You still a little kid. You always gonna be a little kid. Your age determines your little kid. Your maturity level determines if you're a little kid or not. Right now, you just do a fit for no reason. I asked you, had you told anybody? Um, that was me confiding in you, um, trusting you, um, allowing you to tell me the truth, but you still took it as an insult. So you're a dumbass, boo-boo-ass rugrat until further notice.